In today's Medical Apps Masterclass, we will study about Repoport, Lubering Cycle. This cycle is also called as 2,3 bisphosphoglycerate shunned. This is because Repoport, Lubering Cycle is mainly concerned with the synthesis of 2,3 bisphosphoglycerate in the RBCs. Now, before we move ahead, and, understand this cycle, let us first understand an important concept. In all cells, during glycolysis, a series of reactions convert glucose into pyruvic acid. However, specifically in RBC, the conversion of glucose to pyruvic acid, takes a very different route. So, the start, and, end product, for both glycolysis and repoport lubering cycle is same, however there are two important difference which we see moving forward. The first important difference, is creation of a special intermediary. 2, 3 bisphosphoglycerate in the rapoport lubering cycle. It is because of creation of, 2, 3 bisphosphoglycerate that this cycle is also called as, 2, 3 bisphosphoglycerate cycle. Now, bisphosphoglycerate plays a very, very important role in, release of oxygen from RBCs to tissues. So, hope you understand that in RBCs, to create bisphosphoglycerate, which, is required to modulate the transfer of oxygen, there is an alternate pathway, to glycolysis which converts glucose to, pyruvic acid. Let us now look at the, various reactions involved in this cycle. As the first step, glucose is converted into glyceraldehyde 3-phosphate. Then as a next step glyceraldehyde 3-phosphate, is converted into, 1,3-bisphosphoglycerate. This reaction is, catalyzed by, dehydrogenase and, there is an associated conversion, of NAD to NADH plus H. Also from this step there are further two pathways. One leads to the formation of, 2,3-bisphosphoglycerate while other directly proceeds to formation of, pyruvate via, formation of, 3-phosphoglycerate. So, there is a pathway wherein, 1,3-bisphosphoglycerate first converts itself into 3 phosphoglycerate and then, into pyruvate. Now in the shunt, 1,3, bisphospho, glycerate is converted into, 2,3 bisphospho, glycerate with the help of enzyme, bisphosphoglycerate mutase. The amount of this shunt is controlled by the requirement of, 2,3 bisphospho, glycerate by the RBCs. Ultimately, all the 2,3 bisphosphoglycerate is converted into, 3 phosphoglycerate with the help of 2,3 bisphospho, glycerate, phosphatase, and finally converted into, pyruvate. So as a recap, this cycle takes place in, RBCs with a primary aim of production of, 2,3 bisphospho, glycerate. This 2,3 bisphospho glycerate is very important, in release of oxygen, from RBC2, tissue. An increase in level of, 2,3 bisphosphoglycerate shifts the oxygen dissociation curve to, right and hence, decrease the affinity of RBC to oxygen, thereby releasing oxygen. We will learn more about oxygen dissociation curve, in Physiology Medical Apps Master Classes. And finally there is, no ATP production in, 2,3 bisph- Let's finally review, the main exam points asked from the cycle. Point number 1, Repoport. Lubering cycle occurs in, erythrocytes. Point number 2. The significance of this cycle, is mainly as 2,3-bisphosphoglycerate combines with hemoglobin, and reduces affinity towards oxygen. Point number 3. Now this, 2,3-bisphosphoglycerate shifts the oxygen dissociation curve to right, due to reduced affinity towards oxygen. Point number 4. There is no ATP generation in this cycle as, 1 ATP generated, during glycolysis in the RBCs is utilized. Point number 5. Under hypoxic conditions. 2, 3 bisphosphoglycerate increases, in RBCs. Point number 6. Cancer cells switching to glycolysis, even in the presence of adequate oxygen, for oxidative phosphorylation, called, Warburg effect. Let us end today's Medical Apps Masterclass, by having a look at the brain teaser question, for today. ATP generation occurs in Repoport. Lubering cycle. This statement is true, or false. 
If you know the correct answer to this question, write in the comment below. Also, do not forget to subscribe to Medico Apps Masterclass by clicking here. Once you have subscribed, then click on the bell icon if you want to receive a notification whenever we upload a new Medico Apps Masterclass. Do not forget to check out this next Medico Apps Masterclass, which I feel will be very helpful for you.